G'day, today we're going to have a look at the mini metro level of Chicago and the achievement that comes with this one called 106 miles where you need to uh, deliver 1400 passengers with no more than eight stations on each line. So what we'll do is we'll just start with our red line. This, um, this is my second look at this level. Um, I did not have luck on my first attempt. Um, but one thing I have noticed in these two attempts is that the, it looks like the squares come on the east side of the river. Uh, so whether that's going to cause problems for us or not, I guess we'll, uh, we'll find out soon enough. Okay. So one, the main thing that obviously we need to do is just make sure that we don't overload any line. Um, so what we might do is while we've got a few lines we might just sort of spread out our uh, lines and, and once we get sort of close to having probably more than uh, six six stations on any line we want to count how many uh, stations we've got on each line each time we add anything. Carriage would be good but we're going to take the bridge just because it seems like every line is going to have to cross the water to get to um, this square that's going to be our hub that all our lines connect at. Now that's not too bad positioning, it's still relatively close to the to the center point where everyone's going to drop off their uh, pentagons. Now I think what we really want to do is try and get as many lines as, as quick as we can. Uh, so anytime it offers us a line, we want to use it and we want to divide up the workload so that there's a lot of little lines um, doing the work. So far, we've, we didn't get offered a line in that first one, but that again is just the luck of the draw. And now, I'm not a fan of how far away some of these uh, some of these stations are. So we've got to play the hand we're dealt. So I'm not going to build there yet. I'm going to hope that we get another line, and I'll build up that way. Oh, that's unlucky. All right, so we'll take a carriage. Um, and what we might do is we'll just get rid of that for now. So we'll go one, three, four through that way. Uh, and we will give this guy to... Uh, we'll go yellow for now. So yellow is one, two, three, four, five, six. These guys are one, two, three, four, five. Um, already both of these lines are getting much longer than I would have preferred they were. Um, but we're just hanging out for that extra um, extra track. So what I'd like to do is make this a line here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Not great that we've got so many circles at the end of this line. In fact, what we might do is get rid of that circle off this line, because I just realized that uh, red doesn't have a circle on it. So we'll give them a circle so they don't have to drop those off to someone else. Um, that's stacking up, but wow. I don't, I don't hold much chance for us if we're still not getting a, a fourth line here. Okay. So we'll take that off this guy. We'll just count them out. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, and we will swing that way up to him. Uh, and we'll give them another train. One, two, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's their eight. Uh, we'll give them a train. I would be amazed if this ends up being my uh, my successful run. This has been very unlucky to have no no lines yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I can't add him to yellow unless I get rid of something from yellow. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight. 
Finally. All right. So we'll just pause for a second. We'll get rid of one, two, three. Alright, we'll go one, two, three, four. Um, trying to think about the way we've got this designed here. So we'll give. Um, well, we'll just hold on to what we've got for now. If we get close to. Um, the reason I don't want to use the interchange yet is generally you want to use the interchange as your final um, saving grace. So this obviously is going to be the station that has a lot of stuff dropped at it. So we probably will end up making that the interchange. Um, but until it's needed, just in case you're like say on 1350 and you've got one station that's about to collapse, you may as well have that in hand. Uh, there's no point in using it before you actually do have a station that's about to, uh, to collapse on you because it's got too much stuff. Now we might give the carriage to Red. Red's line isn't overly long, but um, he does seem to be getting a little, a little bit overwhelmed. Not as bad as, I mean, because you can see as well now, because of this change, Red has got, um, Red has got two uniques on its line, so it's going to be the one that people are going to be wanting to drop stuff off to. All right, so what we want to do is get a line that's going to go sort of. Oh, that is savage. Give us some, give us some extra lines, buddy. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we'll go seven to that one. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. These guys can have another train. So they've got three trains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Don't like the design of some of those lines. If we if we get another line, we definitely will uh, rebuild this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So now he's at max capacity. He's at max capacity. He's at max capacity. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So without getting another line, we only have one more station we can add. All right, let's give Red that extra train. No one's getting that guy until we end Sunday, and fingers crossed for a line. There we go. All right, so let's pause for a second. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, what I don't like about this line is how we're going to have so many circles in a row, so we'll try and break it up so there's a square sitting in the middle of them, but you can see at the top he's very overwhelmed by triangles. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, so we'll get rid of one, two, three. So he just goes straight out, one, two, three, and we'll go one, two, Three, four. This is one, two, three, four, five. All right. And we'll give we'll give the carriage to the green. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So what we'll have to do is just pause for a second. Look for a line is not looking too overwhelmed, which will be orange at the moment, because he's just got a little bit less work. We'll give that to him, we'll take that off him. We'll give that circle to these guys, and blue can take that one on. Now what we might need to do is just move this guy, so we'll shift him up there. Although this guy might get bit of extra room anyway. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. What we might do is um, take these two off this guy and we'll just 
rotate his line around that way. Not one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, not too much we can do with this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's now got a unique, so his job just became that a little bit harder. The problem is, even if I get a line to get to this guy, I'm going to need a, a crossing to, to get over there too. But let's not even give me a line. Alright, so I think that maybe yellow needs that, and we'll give the, the train to these guys. Wow, alright, so... Um, no train line is double crossing the uh, the river. What we'll do is we will get rid of those three and just sort of let that remove them. We will put the diamond in here because we we want the diamond and the cross to be addressed first. We'll then go through there, through there. It's one, two, three four, five, six. So we're just going to leave it like that for a moment. And we'll just let these guys clean these ones up. And what we'll do is we'll just have a look to see what ones of these stations at the top get. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So only one of these three circles is going to have a line attaching to it at any point at the moment. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can join that guy to this line. Double check that one. It's definitely not attached to there. So we'll go, oh, sorry, sorry, train, eight. So we'll disconnect him and him from this line and go to those two. Just keep an eye on red to make sure it can clear this station out. We might just drag that guy out and put him there to address the problem. Blue is one, two, three, four, five, six, that is seven. Okay, and you can see at this point we're now at uh, 1,150. Now that is really actually handy to have at the top here. The only problem is we don't have the um, the manpower to get to it. So what I'm going to do is just yank this yellow guy from here and put him there. Now that those two are empty, we'll clear them out and go those two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll take the line, thank you very much. But again, we can, all we can do up here with this line is luckily there is a free triangle, square, circle, circle. And we'll go um, plus. And so that guy can move things to that plus. Alright, now this is where we will make this interchange that is now getting pretty full. Um, and we will just keep an eye on these ones, these little spot fires, because we're now 150 people away, and you can see that does tick with decent pace at this point. So we just want to make sure that we're looking for any station that's overflowing. Because hopefully I've done my math right to this point, uh, and I haven't given any line more than 8 stations at any point. Uh, we will find out in 60 people, I suppose. I'm not even going to worry about giving these to anyone just to avoid risking putting eight stations on the one line. We just want to cross everything as we get 15. There it is. 1,400 people. Not too hard, that one. Um, that's what I say, second attempt on that, and you can see I was very unlucky with the, the amount of lines I was being offered. Um, I'm not going to really try and max this one out, I'll just sort of run, it, run to its uh, its conclusion. Um, any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. Um, if there's any other games that you've, you think I'd either enjoy just playing, based on the style of games I, I play, or even the one that you'd like to see me um, uh, offer up some solutions for, um, feel free to chuck them below as well. I'm always always looking for new games. Until next time, I'll, uh, I'll catch you later. See ya.